Right. Back to the boredom. What? فلتصحبك السلامة في رحلتك باسم I knew it was you You are not the only one with eyes that see afar So, Tabed You have filled the streets with eyes and spies Such is the life of a Rafiq Without my knowledge, huh? where would we be? Knowledge is a tool, a weapon. It can be used for good or ill. And the Order is using it for ill indeed. What have you learned? Rot runs deep through the House of Wisdom. They are using some ancient book, hoping to build a wicked device. Mm. I have heard rumors of this blasphemous contraption. They call it their great work. The Order is experimenting on people. Lethally. I have stopped them for now. But someone called El Rabisu is running things at the House of Wisdom. Mm. Any idea about who this Rabisu character could be? I have my suspicions about the great scholar, Fazil Fahim. That fragile old man? The clues I have gathered tell me so. Hmm. It could be. The House of Wisdom will be hosting a great symposium soon. An informal gathering of scholars. A lecture, refreshments, chatter. Even the great Arib will attend. Go. Spy out this puzzle with care. But do not throw your blade at the symposium. We don't want to show our hand just yet. Hmm. But if Fazil is guilty and alone, then like a viper, strike. But you must be sure. Before I act, I will be sure. Pardon me. I am looking for the great scholar's lecture. Basil Fahim's lecture about the antediluvian antecedents of humanity will begin soon. In the meantime, please enjoy our ample stock of exquisite delicacies and tasty refreshments. All right. So it's going to start soon. Where is Arib al Ma'muniya, the poet? Oh, we got an eavesdrop. Oh, here we go, yeah. Where is Arib? I hope to catch a whiff of her magnificent aura. So rare to see her outside of the round city. The beloved is in the garden, ruminating upon the perfection of nature. Oh, to be a flower held in her discerning hands, inspiring such languid verse. She must be relieved to be free of her wealthy patrons for a change. Oh, perhaps she leads an exciting secret double life, slipping out of the palaces to find inspiration in common life. I doubt it. I told you I'd see you around. Indeed. And what brings you back? I want to show you something. What have you got to show me? This house of wisdom boars collect the wildest trinkets and gadgets. I have been here before, Nihal. This is Ahmed ibn Musa's office. Have you been sneaking in there? Ahmed and his brothers are capable of designing some fantastic devices. Not all of his ideas are that practical, I'm afraid. Don't be so smug. The world is full of wonders. Does this remind you of your nightmares? No. More like something from the Bimaristan. Or a training chart of the Hidden Ones. Ah, yes. The swift ways to kill silently. Death in seconds. It gives me a tingle down my spine. Like I'm nearing a cosmic secret. 
You read too much about magicians and lost cities buried beneath the dunes. You don't read enough. Perhaps there are other worlds, other people, out among the stars. Nonsense. This. I have seen this one before. Is this what you wanted to show me? Yes. It reminded me of that object we found at the palace. What is it? A drawing from an ancient book. There is something you are not telling me. You do not want to know what happens behind closed doors. Why? Because you do not know either? Because, as Dirwish says, sometimes it is better not to know the truth behind the things we must do. The truth, Basim, is that everything is here, in front of you. But you refuse to look at it. This is about you. It has always been about you, ever since that night. I took an oath, Nihal. To leave my old life behind, and walk this path of shadows. And maybe someday you will find the light. But until then... I will walk behind you, every step of the way, to remind you not to forget who you are. Is that a threat? I do not know. I am honored to make your acquaintance. Good to see more young people enjoying the House of Wisdom. Do you think the great scholar will give a good lecture? Do not waste time listening to his nonsense. I have written many more edifying and practical books instead. On which topics? I have written extensively about sundials, astrolabs, stars and planets, and the circumference of the Earth. Fascinating, Sayyidi. I shall read more of your work soon. Wadaan. Ah, uh, this is bugging the hell out of me. All right, let's go talk to this guy. Hunain, you should not be back so soon. I know. I'm still nervous, but I couldn't stay away from my books. I guess we must always do our duty. Wadaan. Attention, symposium attendees. The great scholar's lecture will begin after a short delay. Meanwhile, enjoy our bounteous snacks and the sparkling wit of your fellow guests. There is that poet, the Bidlov, whose work keeps turning up in unexpected places. Spirit of the sands, pilot of desert ships, yes? Symmetry of sky and sea, but only in thine eye do these two planes meet. You have read my work. And who might you be? A lover of poetry, nothing more. And of order, or should I say, chaos. I know only one living poet who loves chaos that much. Ali ibn Muhammad. Are you a fan of his pedestrian work? The rivalry between you two is legendary. It enhances the craft. I cannot choose. You are most diplomatic. But I would rather seek inspiration among these lovely blooms. Good day. Pardon me. Is Fazel Fahim's lecture ready to begin? Indeed it is. Head inside, if you please. Welcome, one and all, to the House of Wisdom, center of learning in Baghdad, indeed, of the entire world. I am Fazil Fahim Al-Kimsa, first scholar of the House of Wisdom, wisest of the wise. Today, I will shock you with what may sound like outrageous blasphemies. 
<laughs> Do not fear, good people. Though I am old, my mind remains sharp as steel. Today I speak of mysteries, of creatures from the antediluvian age. Do not the ancient prophets tell us about giants from before the flood who forsook Allah and worshipped false idols? Is it not possible these giants built marvels, works of wondrous power, now lost to us? Zahra and Hassan are both dead, slain by an assassin's blade. They're dead. Sayidi, I urge you to hide until it's safe. Uh, uh, apologies, people, but our lecture has concluded. Please, feel free to explore the House of Wisdom's many fine chambers. You call yourself the great scholar, Fazil. You who burn books and hope the smoke will hide your crimes. How many did you sacrifice in your search for knowledge? How many did you use, damage, and discard in the name of discovery? Now you hide within the House of Wisdom. The house you led astray. But I will find you. And I will exact justice for every soul you savaged for your great work. I just love how Assassin's Creed uses a trailer right before you kill the guy. That is fucking dope. I, I'm pretty sure they use it in other Assassin's Creed, but I haven't played it since Syndicate, you know? So this is really fucking awesome of how Ubisoft did this. It is true. Fazil leads the order in Abbasia. I need to hunt him down. Gatekeeper, let me pass. Those who came before are... What are you talking about? Those who came before are... Let me get back to you. I've lost Fazil's greatest work. How exciting. What do you think frightened the great scholar? The old fool must have imagined one of his antediluvian creatures. He's an absolute disgrace. But where did he run off to? There's rumors of hidden passages beneath the House of Wisdom. Maybe he hid down there. I have heard the rooftop gardener mention these places, yes. What a colorful detail to include in my verse. The scholar, by secret tunnels fled, chased by delusions of deities who want him dead. What do you mean you lost the great scholar's masterwork? I'm sorry. I was distracted by the presence of the famous poet Arib. Forget the poet. We better find Fazil's book or we're both dead. Sounds like part of a passphrase. That book looks out of place, wedged behind a desk like that. A history of the great scholar and his magnificent reforms of the House of Wisdom by Fazil Fahim. Not sure if this is the correct volume. Now do me a favor. If you hear anything... Hey! Don't worry! It's my tool! Don't worry! Anyone see what's going on? If someone comes begging for death, we 
Hold on! Hi! What? I better not use my weapons here. The folly of poetry by Fazil Fahim. Does not sound too romantic, to be honest. An impressive volume, written by Fazil Fahim, could be his masterwork. Its title is, Those who came before are those who shall return. This has to be it. Gatekeeper, those who came before are... ...are those who shall return. Correct! You may proceed. Use my weapons again if needed. Alright, so in this clip right here, I picked my throwing knives and I was hoping I could hit the knife into the barrel of fire right there so it could explode on him and it could kill him. So when I pull out the knife, that's what I'm hoping. But I'm pressing L2 and I pressed R2 and it made me do that shit. So once I did that shit, my, my stealth was completely fucked up. I had to take like five minutes just to lose this guy, just to kill him right here. Yeah. 
There is a deep wrongness here. A reek of rot and iron. Those robes might help me get closer to Fazil. Please, take me back there. I don't belong here. What have they done to these people? All right, let's see what let's see what this does. Do I have to switch clothes? This guy will not need this anymore. Oh, I am switching clothes. This should help me blend in. Oh, okay. At least I have my my blade. That's good. Help you avoid detection, certain locations. As long as if you are detected, vanish and become an item. Right All right, cool. All okay. Ah. I can't assassinate him. Okay. Next subject in here now. All right. There are horrors here, but the most terrifying thing is that I have seen it all before. Somehow. Who dares meddle with my great work? Killing my allies and spoiling my lecture. It's an outrage. It looks like the handiwork of a trained assassin. Must be some faction in the round city. Or one of those jealous broods in Shakti. These killings were too subtle for mercenaries. No matter. Once I understand how the mechanism works, I will prove myself to Al Bahamud. Al Bahamut. Okay, so that's the the next guy. I'm gonna see how this goes down. This reminds me of Assassin's Creed Unity, where you use a disguise. I think it was Arnold's first assassination, and he used that disguise to play that dude, and he kills him right here. I should blend in before it is too late. You are new, aren't you? I don't recognize you. They promised you gold when you volunteered, yes? No matter. What you are about to behold surpasses all worldly riches. Don't be afraid. Are you afraid? All right. This is my great work. I call it Arua. It will take you on a journey to another realm. Why did the first ones leave this world behind, filled with fools, I wonder, and make so few of me? We call this the House of Wisdom, but its foundations are unsound. For beneath the House of Wisdom lies the Dungeon of Ignorance, and upon such dark secrets we build our philosophies. Science is the noblest purpose. Knowledge is the greatest power. No. Uh-oh. It's about to happen. No. Then what? Oh yeah, let's do this. Justice. This may be the place. It may be here where lies absolute knowledge. It is not how I remember it. Behind the doors, it looked brighter. Your rain comes to an end. But in the end, all we see is darkness. Is his nightmare going to attack him again? I think it is. Yep. Oh, 
Oh my god. I need to get out of here. Get back to the bin. Wow. I just felt like doing that shit to be honest. Almost home free. Here we go. Perfect. Basin Ibn Ishaq. How did you find this place? Easy. I just followed the trails of blood. You should not be here. Do you talk to him? Sometimes. Yes. But he does not answer. I do. We have drifted apart since... ...since that day. But what we have seen, back at the palace... ...this light... ...these sounds... ...we cannot have possibly forgotten. Unlike you, Nihal... ...I keep the past... ...in the past. You call yesterday the past? And this jinni of yours, this repulsive shadow that crushes your chest, has it crawled back into the past too? No, it is still here. Sometimes, even in the day, I feel its breath on my neck. The nightmare invades the real world, or has always been part of it. This is part of your reality, Basim. I am a part of your reality, too. I am your past. Tell me, will you leave me there? In the dark corners of your memory? I will not. Now, if you could invent a mechanical rug sweeper, Basim. It is done. And how did it all play out? I'm afraid this is a tale for another day. We will save it for one of our campfires. You have done well, my friend. Better get back to my work. You know how easily I get bored. Thank you for what mm. you did, Basim. It is the truth. You have done well. One last thing. Arib. Was she... involved? Not that I know. But we must remain vigilant. All right. We're going to end the video off here. That is it for the um the Master Assassin suit. I have one more suit to showcase. Um let me go to it. I done this. This this. Now I'm going to do this one right here. And then this will be our last um Damn, I just can't get over to how the Master Assassin suits just looks. It's fucking awesome. Just black and gold. It's perfect. But that was a that was a good episode. It took me oh I mean episode. It took some time just to find that book and the place and everything. It took me almost over an hour just to find. But in editing it's gonna be like 20-30 minutes the most. But that's gonna be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like and subscribe if you're new. And I'm out, man. Peace.